Now, here in this room, what we wanted to do was give you an idea of how to execute a mid-century modern, and I'm gonna go with home office because it's 2021. I actually started with the chair. That was my inspiration. Work from the chair. I love this pop of color. This red chair is from overstock.com and I love the shape. And let's get honest for a second about a desk chair. It must be comfortable. But this is really great on your arms as well as a back. You can sit in it honestly for hours like we're stuck doing. And then don't forget to get up out of it and stretch every once in a while. So for me, this was my beginning focal point and then I built around from there. I love this lamp. I found it at Home Depot. This art I think is really true of a mid-century style, which is to break up a single piece of art into two pieces and separate it. It's very innovative. It's got this cool edgy black sort of painterly swatches and swipes in the middle connecting it. And I found those at uh, Crate and Barrel. Um, speaking of Crate and Barrel, I also found this globe. I am a big globe collector. I actually probably have about 50 globes at my house. There's something that not only I love decoratively, but in this modern age, I love to tell my children when we used to travel where we're going on the globe. It's educational and it's soulful. Now, this rug I love, it's from Ikea, and the circular pattern in it to me harkens back definitely to mid-century. So a lot of ways that you can execute a very pointed design style is available on modern websites everywhere. It's just about having references, building a mood board, and then building it thoughtfully piece by piece. Maybe don't go to one vendor for everything, that also is really helpful in design no matter what you're doing. When it comes to design, you wanna remember the journey of how and where you found that. And that will, as Marie Kondo says, spark joy. And VFFs, we wanted to help you add some mid-century style to your homes. So each of you are getting a $100 gift card from Costa Farms so that you can go buy a plant like we have here. Because there's one thing I will say about bringing the outside in. I don't care what decade or time period you're in, that is really timeless to have nature in your space.